So obviously so, I'm mindful that I don't want to show Josh up. Um, he's been very good and come all the way down from Auckland to be with us today. So I will intentionally be making a few mistakes. Um, see if you can spot them. Yeah. You know I'm listening, right? <laughs> <laughs> doing a, a really beautiful meet and greet actually because I haven't met Pete before and we're, uh, we're working through the brewing process of a beer, he's taught me a lot. Uh, Garage Project's producing an amazing beer um, to be served in-house, Brew, brewed especially for us based on you know to, to um, work with the food so super excited about that. So we're doing a very simple Pilsner base um, and we're going to dry hop it with some lovely citrus hops. At the end of the day it's going to be really clean. Um, very smashable. You know, we talked about this beer being a supporting actor. Yep. Like it should be best supporting actor. Yeah. It's not going for the lead role. Yeah. It should be just like playing along nicely. Josh is just helping a little bit. Ah, <laughs> oh, there we go. Flip it up in the air. Yay! Let's go, do it. Yeah, Hawker and Roll is a new fast casual concept that we're doing. Uh, we're really taking the, the, the best ideas of uh, Madame Wu and the dishes that people really love um, and putting it into a little bit of a tighter format. Uh, we're focusing on Hawker Rolls. So, roti, meat, sambals, uh, generally lettuce or some cabbage for a bit of freshness, yep. pickles for a bit of acid, a uh, bit of chilli, a bit of spring onion, a bit of coriander, a bit of herbs, whatever else. That's it. Pretty good. Yeah, that sounds awesome. Uh, good. Have you had one before? <laughs> what have you been doing with your life? God, that's good. Yum. Good. Oh, incredibly. Yeah. That is a highlight having you here today, is just chatting through the ideas yeah. for this beer that we're going to yeah. be doing with yeah. Hawker and Roll. Yeah. Loving, I think, I think we're on the right path. Well, he's got more. He's got more silver going on because he's got that massive beard. Otherwise, I think it will probably be a pretty much a tie. I've had grey hair since I was 21, but um, yeah, nothing wrong with a couple of old silver foxes, eh? That's key. Key is to make a few mistakes. I'll put the right. I, you need to tell me to step back, you know, because I can't help you're doing, it. In my you're hands doing great. Right 